Ostom M050 Rear Bluetooth Stereo APDX Headphone Wireless High 5 Skype Chat with Noise Cancelling Microphone. M05 headphones can't be used both wired, 3.5mm standard audio cable, and wireless, Bluetooth V4.0, 40mm speaker drivers cap text technology and full range frequency deliver powerful sound crystal clear vocals and deep bass super soft ear cushion provide you no press of long term. Comfort, rotated ear cups for easy storage, and transport 400 amp rechargeable battery gives you over 20 hours of both talk time and up to 250 hours standby time each pair of headphones from Ostom comes with our 100% satisfaction guarantee and one year warranty. Rock your ears rock your ears by rich bass and powerful sound with Austin M05 headphones can't be used both wired, stereo audio, only in wireless powerful sound crystal clear vocals and rich bass special design for comfortable wearing and convenient storage easy control for audio slash phone call and outstanding long play time product features can't be used both wired, stereo. Audio, only in wireless Bluetooth V4.0 technology provides wirelessly high quality audio transmission 3.5mm audio cable connects to any non-Bluetooth device or use the headphones without a battery charge powerful sound crystal clear vocals and rich bass 40mm speaker drivers produce powerful sound CSRB TV 4.0 plus EDR with Aptex. Chip gives you high 5 sound full frequency responses, 20 HZ 20 kHz, provide rich bass special design for comfortable wearing, and convenient storage soft ear patent over ear design for hours of no press listening advanced fold flat design for convenient storage BR easy control for audio slash phone call, and amazing long play time. Built-in mic for headset functionality with controls for audio and phone calls 400M battery guarantees 20 hours play time and 250 hours standby time technical specifications Bluetooth CSRV 4.0 talk and play time 20 hours standby time 250 hours charging time 2 to 3 hours what's in box Ostom M05 headphones USB charging cable 3.5 mm audio cable 4 feet 1.2 meters user manual mesh bag I had really high hopes for these headphones they look sleek and expensive and since they are about 80 to 90 bucks you do expect a sound quality that's a step above your average Bluetooth headphones. While I think they sound pretty good I was a little underwhelmed br I'm fortunate enough to have lots of companies sending me headphones for testing and review. As I type this I can see above 30 different varieties of the popular Amazon headphones sitting next to me. Most of them are terrible to average. These definitely sit in the upper echelon pile. I've used them a few times at the gym, since I received them, and also listening around the house. My background is in audio production and some sound engineering. I'm not a full-blown audiophile. I'm not that good. My review falls between an audio professional and a casual listener. Everyone's ears like different things so there is no one opinion on headphones, that is absolutely right Pyros. 1. These look awesome. Different textures. Soft headband and ear cups. Great fit around my ears. Lightweight and could wear them for hours too. Dedicated buttons for everything 3 buttons under each side. Volume up slash down slash power, track forward slash play, and pause slash track reverse. It's really nice not to have to hold down one volume button for multiple seconds, to skip a track 3. Ability to hook an 1 8 cord up to your device, if the battery dies or you want to go wired to slightly increase audio quality 4. The mic that's housed in the left ear cup is really large. It blends right in and looks sleek, but that mic is way bigger than most headphones like this. It definitely helps during Kalsk, although I would rarely use a headset like this for that purpose. 5. Ear cups swivel out, delay flat for storage. They are tight too. When you turn them in, or out they stay that way. 6. Battery life is ridiculously great. Charging won't be a concern at all, unless you wear these all day every day. 
Way, way better than most Bluetooth headphones 7. Signal state connected walking all over my house. I'd say the advertised 30 feet is a cure attack depending on angles and walls 8. App text capable if your device supports its eons. 1. The tab that goes over the charging port is tough to pry. Maybe it's sticky at first and loosens your PC, but you hardly ever have to charge these. I'm reaching for cons too. Maybe a little too expensive for the sound. A pair of good quiet headphones in this price range would beat these in sound quality pretty easily. You are paying for the convenience of wireless after all sound profile, BR I'm pretty torn about reviewing the sound of these. On one hand they are the best sounding over the air Bluetooth headphones I own. On the Optric I couldn't help, but feel a bit underwhelmed, when I first heard them. My device supports aptX C so in theory I should be getting a better compressed and higher quality audio signal the bass is full and present. It's clear in the 60Hz range, and will please most bass heads. It's not the bassiest headphone I've ever heard but it's there. My ears hear some muddiness around the 230Hz. I cut that frequency slightly and it helps. The treble is clear and distinct especially at 14kHz. Not ear piercing, like so many headphones now. The mids are tricky, because I feel like they are pushed a little higher than most headphones that come out of the box. Most popular manufacturers do a bass boost mid cut treble boost headphone now. I usually tend to turn my mids UPC, but I couldn't get a good grasp on what to do for these headphones. Another reviewer mentioned the mids and highs are muffled. I can see how someone would form that opinion, but I'm not sure that's the most accurate way to describe it. The highs definitely aren't muffled to me. The sound does feel a little closed off in that mid to upper mid range PR. Another thing I noticed was the sound stage for this headphone felt somewhat narrow. If you are listening to an artist or band, it feels like the music is placed too much towards the center as opposed to a wide feel. It's hard to describe, but it has nothing to do with the panning of instruments. Some headphones just have a wider sound stage than authors, and I feel this one could have benefited from that. Close to back headphones have a more narrow sound stage than open back headphones usually. I've yet to hear an open back Bluetooth over the ear headphone as summary. I gave a pretty tough review on the sound, but that may not apply for more than 75% of the people buying this headphone. If you have no idea what I'm talking about regarding the audio, you will probably love this headphone. Would I recommend it? I would. If you are buying only one Bluetooth headphone to wear around the house at work gym, and you like the over-the-air style like this is the best I've heard under $90. I own a few other over-the-air style headphones around the $30 to $50 range like the T2 or TS2. They sound atrocious compared to these. It's definitely worth the extra money. My review stars always take into account the value of the product versus the price it's selling for wireless headphones have two things that you have to consider before buying. You are paying more for the convenience of ditching the wires and you are going to take a hit in audio quality because Bluetooth audio is compressed and sent wirelessly from your device BR I'd be happy to answer any questions or give recommendations. Please click yes if this review helped you in any way. Thanks for taking the time to read my review.